Hi everyone. As you know, we deal a lot with the uh, gut bacteria here and how it affects neurological, you know, inflammation, your neurological functioning. And there's, you know, the phrase you'll see in the headlines, the gut brain connection. Well, I want to tell you about another connection. It's called the gut tooth connection. Okay. Now, something we've seen for many, many years, and it's not a, a rare thing, is uh, we've had adults and that have a history of bad gum disease, the teeth or gums are needing to be scraped, they've got recurrent cavities, or the teeth are brittle and breaking, and so forth. And so they have this kind of problem, but as we're working on balancing the gut bacteria, get the inflammation down for whatever other issue, all the dental problems stop. Gum disease goes away, the, uh, the brittle teeth quit happening, and, um, uh, and it's pretty dramatic. And, uh, you know, some of the patients we follow for many years, and they, they don't have any problems, all right, uh, once you get their gut balanced. And it's, it's a very, very uh, dramatic thing. And so if this sounds like you with all these kind of just ongoing dental problems, even though you brush and you floss and you got the special gargles and you're doing everything you can, uh, you got to think about your gut bacteria and, and uh, don't take probiotics and the inulin doesn't work well in adults. Uh, you need some refaxman to get your gut balanced and I bet most of your dental problems will stop. So hope that's a useful tip for you all out there. Otherwise, everybody have a great day.